So we're spending a lot of time at home these days. So Harper and I thought it would be kind of fun to show you how we make banana bread together. Um, we're gonna make a bunch of it so we can give it out to our neighbors, six feet apart, of course. Um, so we're gonna show you how to do banana bread. A couple things we don't actually have in the house right now, so we're gonna substitute a few of the things that we don't have at the moment. Right now, I am mashing the bananas. So she's mashing three bananas right now that are actually very ripe and they were gonna go bad, so of course we wanted to make use of them. Then she's going to do her two eggs. She's gonna crack them in a separate bowl um, to make sure you don't get any shells in your bread. Nice work, girl. Here, hand it to me. Thank you. Where are the eggs from, Harper? Chickens. Who's chickens? Our chickens. <laughs> That's okay. Let's, oh, oh. That's all right. All right, let's get up. All right. And by the way, just so you guys know, we're actually got the oven already on. It's preset to 350 degrees. All right. Now we're going to pour that in there. That's good. You did great. That's good. All right. Let me take this here. You can give that to me. I'm going to put that in there. Get it all out. Yep. Get it all. We need it all. We need it all. All right. Good job. Thank you. All right. Do you want Should to start? I this you can. You can actually. I'll get you a spoon real quick. Why don't you start measuring out the Greek yogurt? Okay. Right. And then I will get you a spoon. Yeah. Just put it right in there. And just make sure it's kind of level. Yeah. All right. We we'll probably need a little bit more. Yeah. It's hard to get off. Patience. Okay, I like this. Okay. Oh, a little bit more. Oh. All right. Now you put that in your spoon. Oh, it's sour. <laughs> it's Greek yogurt. All right. Put that in. All right. Then we're gonna get your milk. So you know, if you hear screaming, it's actually play. Holt and Daddy are outside playing. <laughs> All right. Oh. Sorry, babe. Okay. Yeah. Next one, we do the it's almond milk. Out. Normally, my recipe actually calls for buttermilk, but we don't have any in the fridge right now, so we're going to use almond milk. All right. This is not looking good. <laughs> it will, though. Here. Hold on. I thought I was doing what? You are. Here. And then we do that way you do a I teaspoon do uh -huh, of vanilla bean paste. It smells the best. Mm -hmm. Oh, it's a lot more easier to do yeah. the vanilla Ooh. paste than Ooh. the vanilla extract. Yeah, definitely. Extract because it's like it comes out a lot like more a, slower. Yeah, for sure. And it smells thicker. Like mm -hmm. mm. Alright, give me that. And then you've got Three fourths cup of sugar, which is right next to you. So yeah. Make sure it's level. Here, good side this way. Yep. Yeah. There we go. All right, gently mix that up. Okay, so while she's mixing that up, it I'm gonna actually, so doesn't it smell good? I'm gonna start actually on the dry ingredients. All right, so we're going to start with flour, and we're going to do a cup of whole wheat, and normally my recipe calls for almond flour, but we're actually out of it, so I am going to use regular flour, but I still do mix it with my whole wheat. I just kind of like the nutty sort of taste that sometimes whole wheat and usually almond flour kind of gives, but we're out of almond flour at the moment. A lot of you guys are having issues with being out of things right now, so we're trying to make do. So, and then here is the almond flour. We use I mean, what sorry, we have. the whole wheat flour. Use what we have. That's right, babe. Ooh. All right. Then we're gonna do a teaspoon. This is a half. A teaspoon of cinnamon and a teaspoon. Of ground ginger as well. Gives it some nice sweetness and heat. Nice heat. All right. Okay. 
Unless when you have, then, yeah. when you have like a big bowl and there's little tiny chunks. It's okay. Like we'll we'll get it mixed it's up. It's really Don't worry. hard to get it. All right. And then we're gonna do the baking soda. I'm gonna also take a whisk. Excuse me, sweetie. And whisk the dry ingredients up, which is a lot easier than your job. <laughs> but it's a lot more funner than your job. <laughs> Funner? Yeah. Someone needs to go back to school. That's not a word. <laughs> sure. <laughs> All right, so this is done. I'm gonna get you your melted butter because it's the only thing we're missing, so hold on. Either way. Funner is my word. <laughs> Already right. taken, people. All right, and then we're gonna gently okay. throw the butter Step. in. Okay. Step. There you go. Whoa, now it just turned into a color I don't wanna see. <laughs> All right, and then we're gonna to start to mix the. It's not mixing what? in. It'll, it'll mix in. Don't worry. No, but it's it will. Like, it will, sweetie. Okay, I promise. Okay. okay. No, but it's like the butter's it in the end. Will. Okay. Okay. No, no, no. We need it. You're gonna help oh. me mix this. Okay. Move this. All right. Little by little, will you start to mix it? Yeah. Okay. Oh, now it's sticking. Well, that's what we're supposed to do. We're making banana bread. Duh. Duh. And now it's kind of making a batter. That's right. That's what it does. Can I borrow that for just one second? Yeah. Let's get the, all the stuff out. Are we going to use a thing? No. Oh. <laughs> it's not slime. You don't even let it. Exactly. Those are for a good reason. Okay, I was getting the sides out for you. Now you can mix this up for me, and I'm going to go get the pants. So we've got our little muffin tins. We're going to actually use small ones today so we can give them out to a bunch of our neighbors. And we're greasing each one a little bit. We're on our last one. Yeah, most of them move around a little bit. Oh, Harper. So here, Whoever likes take a oil, look at that. No, that's the one. No, it's just you got to put it around so it takes the oil and moves it all the way on the edges and on the bottom. That's what's most important so it doesn't stick. All right? Yeah. You want to do the rest of them for me? Yeah. Here. Okay. What? Do the rest of them, and then we'll start to pull them. And then this is going to go in the oven, 350 degrees. Um, and you'll actually, let me just prep this. You want to so fill them up only about halfway. A little more than halfway is It fine. smells really good. Doesn't it smell good? You also, sometimes the kids like to put chocolate chips on the top or inside the batter. That's also really fun. Um, yeah, I'm kind of make a little bit of a variation. Mmm, mmm, smells good. Who wants to test it? How do you test it? Me, 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 okay, me. You both can test one and make sure that it comes out clean. That's when we know it's done. Mmm, hello, pussy. Clean. Yay, okay, hold, you do it. Clean. <laughs> He's like, oh. Last one. Clean. clean, it's done. I hope you guys are having some good family time. Oh. We love you. Smith say love you. <laughs> yes, we live in our PJs.